Right, so reflections. Basically, we've drawn a, um, a line y equals minus x down here, and we're going to reflect this triangle in that line. Basically, we're going to draw, we're going to imagine that this line, this red line, is a mirror, and we're going to say what would triangle P look like in the reflection of the mirror. What you do is you find one of the corners and you draw and you see how far is it the shortest distance from there to the mirror. We go across here and then you go the same distance in the same direction to the other side over here. So that's this point here, which we're going to, I'm just going to call A and we're going to call this one A apostrophe. Okay, so I want you to do the same with the other two corners. Cool. So that's a reflection. And actually, it looks like a reflection in a way, doesn't it? So we, the great thing about these reflections is that they, they will, once you've done them, they will look kind of right. So that's good. So now it says, so this is triangle, um, uh, this is triangle Q. Um, now the next one, it says triangle Q is reflecting the line Y plus minus one. Sorry, X equals minus one. So if x is equal to minus 1, then it doesn't matter what value of y there is, x is always going to equal to minus 1. So it would be a vertical line going up along the minus 1. So I'm going to draw that now. So that blue line, that's the x is equal to minus 1. And we're going to reflect uh, triangle Q in that value um, to... Um, uh, so, so it's reflected in that in that line there. So, do you want to have a go at that? 